Hello everyone and welcome to Long's Toys. Today we'll be taking a look at the January 2018 issue of Tetabi Kun magazine that comes with the exclusive Momotaros full bottle which does have some functionality with the driver that of course we'll take a look at. Uh, does have a combination with the Densha full bottle from the Kaizog Densha set which makes sense because Deno used the train so it's all coming together. But we'll put this off to the side for a moment and we'll dive into the magazine because it's very cool, very colorful. I'm going to kind of move the camera down here. Um, as you can see, we've got Build, Build, got some Ultraman and Q-Ranger down here. Here's Deno showing you the combination with the Denshaw full bottle. Have some uh, Gomberizing cards, even have some uh, Shinkadion because they're making a cartoon of that. So getting a little bit of press for that as well. On the back, giant picture of Build with Rabbit Tank Sparkling. This is the Phoenix Robo set that I believe actually comes out later today. This is being recorded on the 22nd of December. So I believe, yeah, it says December 23, but it's, it's 23 in Japan, it's 22 here. Time differences. So, this is all stuff that is coming soon. This is actually already out. I already have this. This comes out today. So, pretty cool. Very excited. With magazines, they always kind of do the January issue comes out in, in December. I guess to get you excited for for the coming month. But you can see the price up here, 1,090 yen. I got this on Amazon Japan. I got it actually probably a week or two ago, actually. I've been waiting for the Densha bottle to come in so I could show you how that works. But I think I paid somewhere in the area of 900 yen because sometimes Amazon Japan does little discounts, which is nice. So opening this up, sweet. Get some Transformers over here on the side. Some leader class figures from first night or last night. Here we have the Telebi bottle. I have to figure out how to track this down because that looks pretty cool. And then what do we have here? This looks like some kind of fold out. Oh, look at this. All right, hold on. Can we get this going? This is a giant build poster. Let me, I'm going to move the camera back up here. So it looks like it's rabbit tank sparkling. I'm not going to be able to show you all of it, unfortunately, but it's like a big pinup, which is kind of hilarious. Um, this looks fantastic. I'm going to put the camera back down now because it'll be easier. Because of the, I don't want to crease the magazine, but Kuma is bare. So there's a Kuma television uh, <laughs> best match. I love that. Look at this. The TV and the Kuma on his eyes. That is fantastic. That looks like a really fun form. I think it's going to be a Teleby Kuhn magazine exclusive. So let's see what this says. Uh, bought to the DVD. Common Rider Tedu. Common Rider build. So it looks like February. Something start it starts in February. DVD. So I'll have to look into how to get that. But I think it's probably going to be like buy a DVD and get that, and then buy another magazine and get the TV full bottle. So. I will have to do some research because that form looks really cool. And I really hope, one, we get a Soto figure of that form. And two, I have to figure out how to get those bottles. This is just an advertisement for uh, Rabbit Tank Sparkling. So there you go. Let me fix the camera again. I do apologize. It's hard to get a good angle. So now we just have some more Rabbit Tank Sparkling stuff. Octopus Light. Uh, I'm going to try to flip through this pretty quick. These are all different combinations with Octopus Light. Here is him fighting Kroz. So that's why I think a lot of people thought he was going to be Claws, which kind of makes more sense because he's a dragon. But it's like Cross, Cross Z. Here is the Santa Cake full bottle, which I do have coming from Bai from Yahi Japan Auctions. Here is uh, Phoenix Robot. Looks like a pretty cool form, I have to say. I think that's a movie form, but I might be wrong. Whoa, look at this. Who's that dude with all the gears? He's pretty cool. Hyper Muteki. Here is the Momotaros full bottle. 
I really can't get the camera at a good angle, and I do apologize. So, of course, we'll take a look at that in a minute. I'm going to have to kind of go through this a little bit faster because Boot of a Soul Medals. Here is some Q Ranger stuff. Looks like Gyokai Watch on the other page. Here's more Q Ranger. Q Ranger, Q Ranger. More Q Tama. So many Q Tama. Look at this kid. Look how much fun he's having. He's freaking out. Look at this little Digimon Pokevice. Digivice. No, see, I'm saying that wrong. Pokemon Pokedex. Haha. -ha. I tried to com I tried to combine Digivice and, and Pokedex, and I got Pokevice. That's not right. Here is a little preview of the Shinkadion cartoon. I guess the Drivehead cartoon did well enough that now they're making a cartoon for Drivehead. No, I said Drivehead. This is Shinkadion. So, I mean, I feel like I have these the old versions of the trains, and they're not super different, so I'm probably not going to buy the official cartoon versions. Here they are right here. I have one that looks almost identical to this already. And they do come with new weapons, and they, they show off the fact that they can, you know, swap pants. But the ones I have can already do that, so it's not really that exciting. So Cars is coming out. Got some Ultraman stuff. Some figures. Getting kids excited. Look at all these toys. Look at, I mean, if I got this when I was a kid, I'd get this magazine every day. Look at all these toys to get excited for. When I was a kid, we had, like, the big Christmas book from Sears to look through the toys. Or maybe, like, a big book from Toys R Us. But it wasn't this exciting. These look much more fun. Got some Soto figures over here. Soto 4. This is a coloring book. Little coloring pages in here. It's pretty cool. Q-Ranger. Kamen Rider. What else we got? Do we have any Ultraman? Yeah, we got Ultraman. Connect the dots for Jeed. There you go. Jeed and Belial. I gotta watch that episode. Some Jeed stuff. More Jeed stuff. This is for the movie, I think. Movie form. Here you go. Here's Drivehead. This thing is awesome. I've already reviewed that. I think I have everything on this page. Very, very cool. Drivehead line was really fun. I really enjoyed it. If you have a means of picking up some of the figures, I definitely recommend it. Here's some more Transformer stuff for last night. Uh, some minions. Some more, like, not really coloring book, but maybe these are. Oh, uh, some manga. Here we go. Yokai Watch manga. I'll pass. But yeah, so really cool magazine. I apologize. I kind of went into it a little bit uh, in depth, but really cool. I think these magazines are fun. It's nice when you get these and they're relevant to, like, what's new. I used to get them when they were super old, so I was like, oh, look at all these old pictures. But this is some new stuff. I mean, uh, Rabbit Tank Sparkling, I think, has only been in one episode so far. So he's relatively new. And I love that bear TV form. I really got to do some research how to get that because I need it. But, yes, so that is the magazine that it comes with. But the main reason we bought the magazine was for this. So let's go ahead and move on to the bottle. All right, so the Momotaro's full bottle. Very, very cool. Just says Momotaro's full bottle. Not really much going on the top. On the back, it shows you how to put it together. I was assuming we would have to put this together. I've never put together a full bottle before, but it can't be harder than putting together Q-Tama, right? And I've done that a couple times. Let's see what we got. All right, so that is all empty. All right, cool. So it kind of looks like one of the metallic ones almost because it is solid in color. So it looks like it doesn't even have a thing in the middle, I don't think. That's kind of a bummer. So when you shake it, it will not make the super fun sound. All right, so let's see. Let's see what we got. We got directions. We got half a full bottle, the front half. We've got the other half of a full bottle, the back half. And then we've got the top part of the full bottle. And then this is the little sticker. So this is clear, empty, trash. Throw that away. I missed. Put that off to the side. All right. So I think the directions should be pretty self-explanatory. But sometimes when I don't check the directions, I get myself into trouble. So we'll take a quick glance. Um, okay, put the top part in, 
put them together. I know how to put it in the driver. I don't need to know all that. All right. <laughs> so take this, put this in here, and then close it up. Line this up, line this up. There you go. So I am a little disappointed. What the heck? Why is there no shake? I mean, this can still spin all around. That's cool and everything, but I need the shake. That's what I'm addicted to. I need the shake. Why isn't that there? I guess they figured it'd be too much of a pain to kind of put that rod in the middle and have you do it yourself. So, all right. So then let's go ahead and put this sticker on. Shouldn't be too difficult. There we go. Make sure that's nice and stuck on there. All right. Here is your Momotaros full bottle. Pretty cool. I like the design, definitely. His head looks great. Got a decent sticker there. This piece spins around. QR code, rail system, number 75. No shake, still bummed. That's alright. Alright, so move all this stuff off to the side. Let's bring in the driver. So real quick before we get to the sounds, uh, I missed this in the box the first time. Have a Gamba Rising card. Pretty cool. I like that a lot. Very nice. So put that off to the side. That was in the box when I was putting the cardboard back in. I, I missed it the first time. So let's go ahead and... Not shake. So I like the sound effects a lot. I think that's really fun. Really, really cool having a Deno transformation there. So standard finishing attack for a best match, but <laughs> I dropped it. But yeah, very cool. I think it's fun that these two are a best match. Makes total sense. Uh, like I said, it's kind of like how the Metals full bottle and the Friendship full bottle use an already existing bottle from another combo to make a logical combination. And I think, obviously, uh, trains were a big part of Deno, so I think that's a really logical combination there. So really cool bottle and a really cool combination so i definitely think this is a fun set and it only costs about ten dollars for everything you get here um the shipping can kind of be a pain the only place i really know of to grab this would be amazon japan and they charge almost as much for shipping as the thing itself costs so that's kind of a bummer but that's only really if you pre-ordered it if you just go grab it when it's in stock you might be able to bundle it with something else if there's something else you're buying and then you could save a little bit on shipping so it's really up to you. The only thing is, I don't know if it's still in stock. Um, you'd have to go check Amazon Japan. But usually with these kind of things, you have about a 50-50 chance of them staying around in stock after they come out. Sometimes they sell out right away. Uh, the only other option will be is if you have somewhere, like a city or something, where they sell, you know, like a Japanese books or magazines. I know there's a couple bookstores, like in New York City, for example, that I've gone into that sell Japanese magazines and things like that. So maybe you might be able to find this in a store like that. Otherwise, I think Amazon Japan is probably your best bet. Um, but yeah, I think it's really cool. For 10 bucks. the magazine, the bottle, I think it's really fun. I love looking at these magazines. They're so colorful and fun. And you see all kinds of pictures of fun toys and, and television show heroes and everything like that. So what's not to like? The bottle is really cool. I miss that it doesn't have the piece inside to shake it. But I understand because you have to put it together yourself. That'd kind of be a little too tricky probably for kids and everything. So I get it. Um, probably be too tricky for me to be honest and probably mess it up somehow. Uh, 
But in either case, it's a really cool bottle, cool magazine. I think the set's worth tracking down if you can get it for a reasonable price. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Please like and share this video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you guys have enjoyed this look at the January 2018 edition of Teddy Coon Magazine with the Momotaros full bottle from Kamen Rider Build. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching.